Hello everyone, my name is Jan C, aka Year of the Collector. We had new comic book yesterday, so I want to continue with my top three most anticipated comics for April 3rd. From DC Comics, we have the marvelous Birds of Prey number eight with Kelly Thompson on the story, David Lopez and Javier Pina on the pencils, Jordi Belair on the colors and Clayton Cowles on the letters. The last issue started with a new arc title on the cover animals with some great news for fans of the OG birds. Barbara Gordon is back on the team as Oracle. I know there were some mixed signals by DC because the cover had her in full Batgirl suit, but no, she's in Oracle capacity as of now. Meridian took off to go back to whatever timeline she's from. Big Barda and Cassandra, Small Bat, aka everyone's favorite, are still on the team. Which personally, I'm happy because the chemistry between these two has been really cool. Also, Cynthia is still walking around with the spirit of Magaera inside her. So, Cassandra and Barda are giving her training lessons. I see this as a major development for the relationship between Barda and Cynthia. If you didn't know, on volume 1 of Birds of Prey, issue number 109 to be exact, Sin was teaching Barda how to play Pokemon cards, which Barda was all about it. I mean, who says Apocalypse only forged bloodthirsty warriors? Seems only fitting that Barda gets to train Sin now that she's all grown up. The plot begins when Barbara and Dina go to visit an old friend. Her name is Mary McCabe, also known as Vixen. There has been a series of failed robbery attempts all over the world, and the common factor has been that all perpetrators have been using Vixen's clothing line. Her clothes are very popular, so maybe it's just a coincidence, but Vixen reveals that she also found herself in the middle of a robbery with no idea how she got there or why she was stealing. So someone is clearly targeting her company and therefore her name and reputation. The only difference between all other victims of this phenomenon is that Vixen was able to escape because of her powers. If not, she would have also gotten arrested. The birds now have more than enough to look into this problem. Since this mystery involves fashion, Vixen offers the birds of prey a perfect plan to work the case. Barda, Cassandra, Dina, and Mary herself will be going undercover in a fashion show as runway models. I bet Kelly Thompson was screaming, are you not entertained when she wrote this story, specifically this part. Big shout out to Kelly Thompson for assembling part of the OG birds back together. Even though I will miss Harley Quinn, the current roster is not lacking at all. Also, great job by Javier Pina on the pencils. Joel Romero gave the first arc a very distinguished look to the birds. But since Jordi Belair and Clayton Cowles are still working this book, that genuine feel and aesthetic is still there. I highly recommend you give the birds of prey a read. You will not be disappointed. That is a good stopping point. Please let me know in the comments what you think. Are you reading the Birds of Prey? If you are, please share your thoughts in the comments section. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day. And remember to read more comics.